What's happening people? We're back with another vlog. A little special one tonight. We've got UFC 300, so just thought we'd watch it along with you. Definitely gonna be a late one, like. It's already just near, just before 11 o'clock here in the UK. Main event won't be walk until about 5 a.m. or something like that, yeah. Which is a killer. There's probably gonna be a few clips of you and me snoring. I'm gonna be honest. First fight walking out now. Crazy first fight this, like you don't see first fight like this very often. Two former champions. This could headline a fight night card, Figueredo vs Garbrandt. I really like Cody Garbrandt, I've spoken to him multiple times in the PI, he's a, such a nice dude, so I, I hope Cody Garbrandt wins here. By the way, he has that red strip in his head. A lot of time left in the round, you like to be getting flat on those. That's under the neck. Tapped. Figueredo won. Another former champion on um, Figueredo's resume, innit? Would have been some good odds on Fig Sub, like. Like being for. Something to eat for Ben's birthday, haven't we? And wait, there was fat and bits of meat left on people's plates, so obviously instead of it, it was just going to go in the bin. And the dog will nail it, so... <laughs> Did you get him catching that? <laughs> full, full bowl of meat. Go. <laughs> Sit. It. So right there. Next fight, my weight division. Lightweights coming out. Bobby Green and Jim Miller. Games to fight either of these. Could end up fighting either of these, to be honest. We'll see. One of these comes out unscathed, yeah. Jim Miller's just caught him there. Yeah, Miller's bleeding now. He, he, he needs to shoot in like his corner said, lad. That eye is a mess. A few people have got it 19-19 going into the third. These one tough dude, this Jim Miller, man. One tough motherfucker. That could be a 10-8 round. I know there's only been two fights, but it's fight at night so far. Very good performance by Bobby Lodd. Very good performance. Hey! How dare you! You <laughs> blimey, slippery little snake! How dare you say my name! I'm going after you! The last! I'm coming to your backyard, with your people, and kick your ass! We knew he was gonna mention me, didn't we? It's the first lightweight that's calling me out tonight, probably not the last. Bobby Green can get smoked. We got Moicano versus Jalen Turner, my mate Moicano. Andrade won by split decision as well, was busy with something there. Stylistically, I think Moicano needs to get onto the floor. Yeah, he's there, he is shooting in already. Yeah, I think first round is definitely... Oh! oh. Shane Turner just landed a big shot down the middle, put Renato, Renato down. That one punch has just lost on that round, definitely. If I was Moicano, I'd be on that single leg or that double leg as fast as possible. Bad boy Carlos will finish him, yeah. Boy Carlos just finished him after getting dropped in the first. Renato, where was the call out, lad? Thought uh, Boy Carlos was going to mention me there, but yeah, props on the performance. That was a very, very good performance. Done well to survive the end of that first round and then come back out and finish him in the second. That was a quality performance by Boy Carlos. Congratulations, lad. Top 10 for you. He is a funny guy. You never know, maybe uh, me versus Moicano. That would be a very good season of the Ultimate Fighter. You never know, you could see that in uh, the next few years. Featherweight's up next. Sadiq Yusuf versus Diego Lopez. That yeah. was it. Was that a short uppercut inside? He's just dropped him with. Oh, yeah, and again. Dropped him again. That uppercut, lad. He was still. That's a early stoppage, that, though. He was fighting back there. He's good, this Lopez, lad. Very good. 1.30 a.m. for all you Americans. Kayla Harris's UFC debut next time, haven't we? So, let's see how this goes. I think she'll take it down or submit her. Kayla's jacked, mate. She's got bigger arms than me. I can't get over how chesty Kayla is. Heavy. Kayla Harrison, second round, rear naked show. Holly tapped real quick, knew it was over. She knew she wasn't getting out. Look at the size of them arms, that squeeze, lad. That could be a title shot next for Kayla Harrison, to be honest, new contender at 135. Probably a title shot for the next. You never know, that could bring Amanda Nunes back out of retirement. Former UFC bantamweight champ, Aljamain Sterling now. Featherweight debut against Calvin Cater. Let's see how this goes. I've met Aljo before, he's a proper nice guy, lad. Real nice dude. Yeah, easily, 37. Mm -hmm. Nice featherweight debut for Aljo, that like, definitely. It's only the second fight to go to the decision tonight after Bobby Green. Got Yuri Prohaska versus Alexander Rakic. Good, entertaining fight at light heavyweight. If I had to pick beforehand, I would have said Yuri. But so far, I think Rakic is landing the better shots. Yeah, I'm, I'm giving that round to Rakic that first round. Oh, Yuri's hurt him. 
wouldn't be happy with that stoppage personally if I was Rocket type, but he is a warrior in me. Fighting night so far for me, like they're both willing to stand there and have a scrap. Very good finish to the prelims there, like I'm gonna have to go and put my pajamas on for the main card to be honest. Get comfy. Main card time, 3 10 a.m. late. Bo Nickel versus Cody Brundage. My man's telling me that this is the biggest favourite ever in UFC history. Let's see if it plays out that way. Here we go. Main card starting. Oh, 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 oh. Poor oh, Cody Brundage might take us back then. Brundage has lasted longer than most of his opponents already, though. I think a lot of people thought he would have had him out of there by now. Brundage quit there, like, he's a good prospect, like he is. Paul Nichols giving the crowd the thumbs down there. End of the day, he's got to finish in the UFC, that's all that matters. <laughs> Snoring his head off, lad. Big fight for the lightweight division. Charles Oliveira versus Armin Suzuki. I like Charles, you know what I mean? I'm a fan of Charles. Something's just happened with Suzuki on the way out there. We're a fan. Suzuki's going to try and out grapple Charles and make him quit. Could have been a choke here already. Oh. Oh. That was a big elbow, we just nearly finished him with the girl team. He done well getting out of that to do here. I'm personally giving that round to Charles because of the submission attempt and he nearly finished him with it. He could have stole that round there because he nearly finished him, you know what I mean? I'm in Suzuki in one round two. It's just I would just go one and three. That one's heavy, that, that could go either way. The longer it takes to these scorecards to get countered and like brought in, the more you think split decision. I'm on by split. Sarukian's probably gonna sit out for a bit and then fight Islam, I think. Because now Sarukian's just won that fight, I reckon he'll do Poirier versus Islam. That's where we saw it from on the UFC page, on the, on the telly. And then there's a fan video there where you see just before it, and it... He throws a punch at a fan. What's he up to? Mad bastard, he can have his purse withheld or anything for that. Is he for real? Big scrap. Holloway versus Gagey. Let's see who's chin lasts longer. Gagey or Holloway, let's do this. Got fight at night written all over it. Nah, no, I don't think that's been a back kick caught him in the face. I think it got him in the body. Oh my god, it did. Heel went straight across his nose. Keeps touching his nose, that is doing his head in. Literally only takes one point from Gagey though to change everything. Yeah. One big power shot, lad, and it just changes the fight. If that counts as getting dropped there, that is the first time he's ever been dropped in the UFC, innit? Did he slip though, or was it a knockdown? That's what I'm thinking. Did he even get dropped properly? Three rounds to one. Fifth and final round. Ooh, that was a nice knee up the middle by Max Star. He's such a savage though. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. That is one of the sickest knockouts I've ever seen in my life. Look at Gagey, lad, he's out. He was gonna win anyway. And he said, let's do this, let's do this, and fucking put him faster, kid. Max Holloway, you fucking legend. And he sleeps him. Oh my god, lad, he's getting 600 grand. Definitely gonna win knockout of the year, that. That was unbelievable. We've got uh, the women's throwaway title fight. I think the first ever time two Chinese fighters are fighting each other for a world title. I think Zhang Wei Li takes this though. I think she's the best throw weight about now. She's just been unconscious. I can't believe that. She just went limp. Well, I know if she wins this now, there'll be an uproar, I reckon. I just knew these fights were going to go for the decision. It's now 5.56 here in the UK. And the last round of this co-main event's walking out. Yeah, fight successful. over. Successful title defence for Zhang Wei. Definitely. AM. In the boy. <sighs> Rough. Main event coming up next, Pereira vs Hill. This one could go either way really, they both got crazy power, so let's see who catches each other on the chin first. I want it to be a scrap, but at the same time, I want someone to get knocked out in the first round here, lad, so I can go to bed. Looks extra focused here, Pereira, like. Uh, <laughs> oh. Didn't and then right after, oh, it's over, it's over. Sleep. Lad, he has got so much power in his hands. It is scary. Put him to sleep, lad. He's been given his black belt as well. That left hook is scary. Another former champ knocked off the list for him. Some event that like, but this is why I don't stay up and watch UFCs. This is why I just get up in the morning and check who's won. Because it's now 
6.33 a.m. It's now light outside where it was dark. But yeah, what an event. Alex Pereira is a machine. Max Holloway is the man. Can't wait to fight again when you watch a card like that. We'll see what happens. My Bobby Green. Ah, uh, there he is getting your head punched in. Easy money. Bedtime now. Peace.